Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video from Ling Ling. Ling Ling is back with another video. There we go. Ling Ling is back with another video. <laughs> Today we're going to talk about a very interesting thing that's happening during Chinese New Year. <laughs> a lot of young Chinese people are pressured into marry uh, early and young and their parents are waiting for them to get married and have some children so they can have some grandchildren they can play around with and tell all their friends about and gain some face and yay. <clears throat> But a lot of young Chinese people, they're like, mm, we kind of want to pursue our career instead of, and we're kind of tired of our parents keep asking these stupid questions. Um, so when they go going home during Chinese New Year, it's very common that the Chinese parents are gonna ask them, so did you get met a boy? Meet a boy? Did you meet a girl? Uh, are you looking for marriage now? When are you gonna have children? If they're married, <laughs> when are you gonna have children? <laughs> uh, if they have a boyfriend, when are you guys gonna get married? Uh, how much do you earn? And all these other things. So a new thing. <laughs> I really think it's so cute, funny. <laughs> but in China now, you can rent a fake boyfriend or girlfriend and you can bring the person back home for Chinese New Year and show your parents that you totally got it. <laughs> Everything is under control. <laughs> Um, uh, what you can do is that you can go online and then you can rent one of these people. <laughs> <laughs> and then you pay them approximately around 800 to 1000 to 1500 RMB a day. <clears throat> um, no sex included, no touching included, just taking them back home because it's very common in Chinese families that when you're with your family, your relatives, you don't touch each other. Um, traditional Chinese people just like immediately when other people are around, they're just like, mm, I don't know you. <laughs> like you say you're my boyfriend, but like. <laughs> not right now um, they're very yeah not touchy so they you can ring you can rent a fake boyfriend or girlfriend and bring them back home to your parents and show them see this is my guy this is my girl I love them <laughs> I love you <laughs> whoever you are and um, they make a fake story about how they met and then they stay together uh, during the Chinese New Year a few days and uh, pretend they're together and everything is fine and then they send them uh, when they go home again they're just like okay see ya bye thanks here's your money <laughs> have fun <laughs> I don't know I think this thing is so random it's so freaking random I'm just like, why not just ask one of your friends to go home with you and be like, okay, so you have parents who are kind of like strict and traditional and want you to get married. And I have parents who are like that. So what if I go back with you for two days and we pretend that we met in university because we did meet in university, but we're just friends, but we could just say that we're together. And then we go to your parents afterwards. No, but, and then we go to my parents afterwards and we do the same thing. And then all of our parents are just not saying anything. And we have a nice time with the Chinese New Year. I don't know, maybe I'm just cheap. <laughs> That's how I thought you could do it cheaper <laughs> instead of renting a person. Um, renting another person seems really weird. But then again, yeah. I don't know. I probably would just ask a WeChat friend. <laughs> but yeah, that's what's going on right now in China. Um, I have uh, a few articles below if you want to read about it. I think it's hilarious. <laughs> um, and uh, guys, I know some of you guys are from China. Please let me know in the comments below if you have ever thought about doing this. Uh, are you in China right now? Are you single? And how are your parents like? Are they expecting you to bring back a girl? Are they gonna ask you tons of questions? Or have you thought about renting a girlfriend or a boyfriend? <laughs> Please let me know, I really wanna know. And let's have a little chit chat about it. And thank you guys for watching. I hope you're having a great day, evening, wherever you are in the world. And Ling Ling is out. See ya and 再见. Bye bye.